And the brushes right here. We're all set. Animal Junction's gonna look even better after we're finished. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to get started. <laughs> Today, we're painting Animal Junction. <laughs> yeah, so all sorts of amazing animals will find us. Let's call Zabu. Zabu! Do you think Zabu will help us paint? Zabu! Zabumafu! Zabu! Oh, he's really leaping today. Zabu, we're painting the place. You want to help us? Zabu? Come on, we have the paint and everything. Want to help? Well, you know Zabu. First he snacks, then he yaks. I'll get him some. Let's see. What a jackpot! Look at all these colors. Zabu's gonna love this. Zabu, I found some garbanzo beans. Zabu loves garbanzo beans. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Vuki and ready, so let's paint. <laughs> hey Zabu, grab a brush and help us paint. Brush, brush, yeah, brush. I think we should paint Animal Junction green. Because green is a yummy color. <laughs> yeah, green is a yummy color. <laughs> yes, yes. Yeah, we'll paint it green and lots of other colors. Lots of colors. That reminds me of the animal I saw. He had lots of colors and stripes. Stripes? Uh -huh. Who could it be? Who could it be? <laughs> this animal who I did see. Can you help me guess this mystery? He had a big furry head in front and a long twitchy tail in the back. He was a playful four-legged creature and he liked to hide. Who could it be? This animal who I did see. At first I couldn't see him, but then when I looked again, there he was. An orange stripey wildcat. Do you know who he is? We can figure this out. Okay, let's see. Orange fur, black stripes. The stripes! That could only be a tiger cub. Tiger cub. Manga striper! Mystery animals here! Martin, what's that sound she's making? She's practicing her growls, Abu, making sure we know that she's pretty tough. Yeah, don't forget, tigers are the biggest cats in the whole world. Brothers, I know big when I see it, and she's not big. <laughs> she's not now, but she will be when she grows up. When she was born, she only weighed as much as a jug of milk. But when she grows up, she'll be 500 pounds or more, as heavy as a motorcycle. Wow. But for now, she's just a stripy little tiger cub. I can't believe my mind how many stripes she has. Yeah. I love tiger cub stripes. I'll call her Stripey. Yeah. OK, Stripey the tiger cub. Hey, what if we paint Animal Junction with tiger stripes? Great idea, Zabu. Yeah, Animal Junction with tiger stripes everywhere. 
Painting is great, no matter what you paint. And no matter what you paint with. <laughs> Come on, Stripey, you can help us. Here's the paint. Whoa. Thanks, Tom. <laughs> Here's the drop cloth and the brushes. I have the hats. One for you, Zob. Hey, thanks. But who turned out the lights? So what do we do first? What do we do first? First, we have to put down the drop cloth. Okay, put down the drop cloth. <laughs> hey, who turned out the lights again? Have you ever heard of a ghost gleamer? <laughs> Let's get started. Okay. <laughs> okay, Stripey, well, hold still so we can see your stripes. Yeah, we're going to Tiger Stripe Animal Junction so the whole place looks like Stripe. <laughs> I'm painting orange and black tiger stripes. <laughs> Way to go, Zabu. It's a good thing all three of us are painting this. It's a lot of tiger stripes. We're almost there. Yeah. All done. Finished. All right. <laughs> Chris Martin, you've got tiger stripes and you're behind. Huh? You both have stripey behinds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Chris and Martin have stripey behinds, stripey behind. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> so we have tiger stripes on our behind. But where's the tiger? Oh. Try looking behind you. Where? Do you see the tiger anywhere? He's hiding in our stripes. There he is. <laughs> Way to hide, Stripey. That's why a tiger has stripes, to hide. His stripes help him blend in with all the shadows of the forest. Stripey, are you trying to hide now? <gasps> I can't believe my mind. <laughs> Look, a new animal visitor, a spotty cat. <laughs> yeah, she's a serval kitten, Zob. Hey, and there's another one. A tiger cub and serval kittens together. It can only happen in Animal Junction. Serval kittens are covered in spots, just like Stripey is covered in stripes. Spots and stripes. Are you thinking? What I'm thinking? Let's paint spots in Animal Junction. Serval spots. Animal Junction will look even better with stripes and spots. Let's do it! I got it. I'm painting spots, black spots and orange fur, just like the serval. All right, and this will be our serval wall. Just lay down the tawny coat like that. And I'll put on the spots. We're finished. All right. Hey, where did serval kittens go? I can hear them, but I can't see them. Where could they be? I don't see them anywhere. Can you see any servals? No, oh, there they are. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the servals blended right into the spots and stripes we painted. Serval kittens have great camouflage. Camouflage? What's camouflage? Camouflage is what helps a creature blend into his surroundings so other creatures can't see him. Take a leopard. Do you see her? There she is. Yeah, good eyes! But you can only see her really close up. You go a little further back, and boom, she's gone! That's camouflage. Hey, what's that sound? Sabu, look behind you! Hmm? Manga and Zika! More animals are here to play with tiger cub and servals. <laughs> I said it once, and I'll say it again. This could only happen in Animal Junction. Kawadis, servals, and tigers all together? Look at this. Kawadis have striped tails. See the stripes? Look at the pattern on a kawadi's face. White circles around the eyes. <laughs> hmm? Kawadis love tiger cubs. Well, they're climbing all over them. <laughs> they went up on the porch, Stripey. Yeah, there they are. Go get them, tiger. <laughs> well, Stripey's so friendly. Wow. 
Monga Chica. Her paws are huge. Almost as big as half a baby kawadi. <laughs> They're having fun. You know what? I'm feeling tiger cubbish. <laughs> I feel different, not the same. This kind of feeling I can't explain. There's only one thing that I can do. I feel tigerish. How about you, tigerish? <laughs> So bad. Tiger. I'm a stripy little wild cat and I know how to hide. Tigerish. Back to painting. What do you want to paint now, Zop? Uh, more tiger stripes. Tiger cub has stripes everywhere. And Dalmatians <sighs> have spots everywhere. Dalmatians? What are Dalmatians? <gasps> Over here, Zob! Dalmatian puppies! <laughs> I'm covered in spots! Dalmatian spots! Spots and stripes together again! <laughs> Dalmatian doesn't have camouflage spots. He has licky spots! We have all kinds of spots and stripes here today. Painted ones and creature ones. Hey, we should paint some Dalmatian spots in Animal Junction. What are we waiting for? Let's go! <laughs> Dalmatian spots are fun because you can do so many things with them. You can do little spots or big blotchy spots. He's up. Let's paint this section exactly like that puppy over there. Which one? That guy. Oh, the little one? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, I love that little guy. I just have one spot on my belly, buddy. He has them all over. Mm. <laughs> Come on, I'm trying to paint. I, that's my paper. Look out. Look out, guys. Uh oh, <laughs> sorry. Whoa! Hey, careful. Oh, it's hard to paint with a Dalmatian pulling on your tail. Whoa! Uh, whoa, 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 wait. Dalmatian, let, no, let go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bet you thought I was gonna fall. Not this time. <laughs> How are we gonna get any painting done when these puppies want to play? That's it. Let's play. Okay, come on. <laughs> yeah. If we tire them out, they'll have to take a nap, and then we can start painting again. Mm -hmm. Come on, puppies. <laughs> Here you go. <laughs> Whoops. Whoa. Hey, come back with my hat. <laughs> <laughs> There's your hat. Hey, <laughs> yeah, come back here. Hey, maybe they're getting tired. I don't think so, Chris. <laughs> oh, I know how to get them to go to sleep. I can tell them a nap time story about one time in Sabu Land. <laughs> Great idea, Zob. Okay, listen up, everybody. Oh, I was leap leaping along. Leap, 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 <laughs> leap, 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 leap. When I bumped into Sensen. Oh, no. He was very excited. Oh, Zabu, Zabu! I really want to test my senses. My smelling, my feeling, my seeing. Can you go hide over there so I can try and find you? Oh, sure, Sensen. On. One, two, three. And I knew exactly how I was going to hide. I hopped over to a striped fruit tree and I ate striped fruit. And then I turned stripey and camouflaged into the striped tree. <laughs> I don't think even sense it can see me here. Say Zabu! I can smell you, but I can't see you. You here? I'm over here. Oh, wow, what senses. My ears are so super, they can even hear a striped tree talking. It's not the striped tree talking, it's me, Zabu with stripes, camouflage stripes. Sensei thought my joke was so funny that he laughed for the rest of the day. The end. It looks like everybody's still awake. Kawadi, Servals, and Stripey are still playing. Huh? I guess my nap time story didn't really work on the animals. But it sure worked on Martin and Chris. Playing with the spotty Dalmatians really tired them out. <sighs> He's sleeping. I just got a great idea. I'm gonna paint Martin spotty. 
Then he'll look just like a Dalmatian. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. And now I'm gonna put stripes on Chris. And he'll look just like stripes. Ta-da! We did it! Stripey Chris and Spotty Martin. <laughs> Hey! Oh! Oh! Hey! <laughs> Thanks for waking me up. I must have fallen asleep during the story. Where's Chris? Chris? Hey, Chris! Over here! Where are you, Martin? I'm over here! Hey! Hey, you're camouflaged by spots! And you're camouflaged in stripes. There's only one creature who could have done this. Do you know who it could be? Yeah, Sabu! <laughs> it was me! I painted Dalmatian spots on you, just like the puppies. And tiger stripes on you, like Stripey. And you didn't even wake up. <laughs> Spotty and Stripey. Mm -mm -mm -mm. The Krat Brothers are Spotty and Stripey. Mm -mm 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 -mm. <laughs> Incoming duck! <laughs> it's not a duck, it's Sticky Feet. The Peregrine Falcon. Yeah, Sticky Feet has stripes too, on his legs. Yeah, yeah. stripes are everywhere in the creature world. Mm. Let's see if Jackie's into stripes. Hi, it's me, Jackie. I was butterfly watching and I discovered how monarch butterflies are spotted and striped. I was looking at these milkweed plants when I found the creature who turns into the monarch butterfly. Stripey monarch caterpillars. Those caterpillars ate the milkweed leaves till they were stuffed. Then they spun a cocoon and they turned into a monarch butterfly with lots of spots. It was pretty amazing. So if you see one of these milkweed plants in your garden, don't pick it. To you, it might look like a weed, but to a butterfly, it's home. Monarch caterpillars have great camouflage stripes. So does Chris. There are all kinds of incredible spots, stripes, and patterns out there in the creature world. So let's check them out. To, to the, the closet. closet! They're going to the closet. They're going on a trip. They're going to the closet to grab their stuff and split. <laughs> 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 oh. <sighs> oh. The closet knocked their spots and stripes off. Manga Zika! Come on! They're going on a cool adventure and they don't know what's in store. They're coming from the closet and they're headed out the door. Bye, buddy. Bye, brothers. Chris and I are in a race to find as many spotted and striped creatures as we can. I'm looking for striped creatures. And I'm looking for spotted creatures. Okay, Martin, let's synchronize our watches. And meet back here at 0900 hours. Got it, 0900. You ready? All right, let's go. Oh. Hey, you, hubba hubba. Whoa, oh, oh. A whole herd of zebra. Now that's a lot of stripes. And all those stripes are great protection from predators like lions. When a lion looks at a zebra herd, it's hard to tell where one zebra ends and the other begins. That makes them harder to catch. But me and my horse don't have zebra stripes, so we better get out of here. I wonder if Martin's found any spotted creatures yet. I didn't even spot you coming. But how could I miss him? He must have the biggest spots in the creature world. And those spots and long neck make a giraffe look like a tree trunk standing in the shadows. Another camouflaged creature. <laughs> Whoa. I better get moving if I want to spot some more spotted creatures. Hey, I wonder how Chris is doing. I'm playing peekaboo with a banded mongoose. Check it 
Check him out. Mongoose stand up like that so they can see over the tall grass. Look at her back. Do you see what I see? Stripes! That's two striped creatures I've seen. I wonder if Martin's having as much luck as I am. Spotted creatures, dead ahead! Are we in luck? A pack of spotted hyenas. See why they're called spotted hyenas? They have spots all over them. But you know, they're not all spotted. Baby spotted hyenas are dark, dark brown with no spots. Well, that's two spotted creatures. Whoa, better get going. All right, I'm sure I'm gonna win this race. Hey, you think we'll get a better view if we climb a tree? Me too. Come on. Spotted creature. A cheetah chilling in the grass. Whoa, and look! More spotted cats coming this way. Cheetah comes. And these little spotted cats really know how to wrestle. Now there's a great striped faced creature. A cheetah cub. 0900 hours. Time to find Chris. Martin! <laughs> right on time! Yeah, and we found some creatures that were spotted and striped. Hey, I also found a spotted hyena. Did you? I saw a banded mongoose. Oh, I love it. Let's keep our eyes peeled. Maybe we'll see a lot of other creatures on our way back. Back to Animal Junction. And you know Zabu's gonna be up to something good. Do you hear Zabu? No, I don't. Well, let's check it out. Hey! What's going on? Whoa, skunk alert. A whole litter of skunks. Amazing. More striped baby creatures in Animal Junction. And they're not just stripey, they're stinky too. If a full-grown skunk sprays you with her stink, it can last on your clothes for a year. <laughs> well, we found five skunks, but where's Zabu? I'm right here, but they'll never find me. <laughs> I'm right here, guys. I can hear him, but I can't see him. Over here. Where is that lemur? I don't know, but if he stunk like the skunks, we'd find him easy. No, no, don't lick me, don't lick me, no, 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 <laughs> no, no, don't lick me, don't lick me, no, 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 you're gonna give me away, <laughs> stop licking, they're gonna see me. <laughs> there he is, <laughs> the puppies found him. Yeah, I'm a new kind of lemur, a spotted lemur. <laughs> hey, have you met the skunks yet, Sabu? <laughs> Stinky. Five stinky skunks. And look at that skunk pattern. That's not for hiding. That's for letting other creatures know that the skunk is here. It's the skunk's way of saying, here I am, and don't get too close or I'll spray you. You wouldn't want to be sprayed by a skunk. <laughs> you trying to climb up my leg? Come on, you can make it. Come on. <laughs> I love it. A striped skunk climbing a spotted lemur. Spots and stripes, together. Right, skunks? Hey, you know what? I remember another story from Sabu Land. I was leap leaping along. Leap, 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 <laughs> leap, 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 when I bumped into Narchi. Oof! I said, hi, Narchi. Uh, hi, I've been wondering, why do you have that spot on your belly? Oh, see if you can guess, Sabu. <laughs> oh, let me think about it for a little while. Hmm. OK, yeah. guess away. I don't know. Okay. Yep. Okay, let's see if Fibby can guess why I have a spot on my belly. Fibby? <laughs> your belly button? Nope, belly buttons aren't smooth and orange. Oh. How about you, Google? <laughs> oh. 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 Can you guess what my spot is? Oh, I think it's a Googleberry stain from when a Googleberry hit you in the belly. Oh, is it? Is it? Huh? Oh. <laughs> Good guess, Google. Oh, That's what? not it either. <laughs> Besides, I like zoot fruit better. Well, I'm ready to guess now. Does it help you to hide? You know, to camouflage you? No, I guess I'll have to tell you. It's there to show me where my belly is. And I gotta say, I think it makes me look good, too. <laughs> so Narchi's spot made us all understand that creatures <laughs> have spots and stripes for a lot of different oh. reasons. The end. <laughs> <laughs> Today was a really spotty, stripey day. <laughs> what was your favorite part, Sabu? Oh, when the spots and stripes played together. <laughs> that was great. Yeah, and I loved it when you painted spots and stripes on me and Chris. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs>
I liked meeting all those incredible spotted and striped creatures. Oh, yeah. This animal is a friend of mine From the tip of his nose to his spiny behind All the friends that we met today Are special in their own way We've all got different names But we're really all the same Thanks for dropping by, we're glad you came These animals are friends of mine They jump and swim, crawl, fly and climb One more thing we have to say Go make an animal friend today! Yeah! yeah. I gotta show the world my spots. See ya. Bye, Zab. And there are so many more spotted creatures out there. Let's keep on hitting the creature trail. Spots and stripes forever. Hi, my name is Matthias Bieber. And my name is Martin Bieber. These are our dogs. 